The patient that uh, came to our clinic was a 65-year-old female from Germany and she has uh, her life uh, style was, and quality of life has been declined so much that her phage was last resort for her and in the past five years she has been a patient at our clinic and the changes that I saw in her life has been mind-blowing. We did not expect so, so much um, to uh, become better and better on everyday basis in her life and she's, uh, she's more than happy uh, to continue the therapy with us because her diagnosis is not something that can be fully cured but managed by bacteriophage preparations where antibiotics have failed already. Also, we as a team from Eliava Clinic uh, have uh, connections with different kinds of doctors and attend uh, a lot of international conferences. All around the world, the interest within the phage therapy is, uh, is very high and we try to make a kit uh, available to a lot of patients abroad and involve lots of different physicians and there is a huge interest, but of course we understand there are obstacles with the phage therapy. Uh, it's not a like, long-term, it's a long-term therapy, it's not a short-term therapy. Phages do not give us uh, very quick results, it's a long term because the infections have been going on for years and years, there is a biofilm, there are lots of obstacles, phages have to overcome, so it does not really work uh, overnight, So, but uh, with the help of other medications involving in phage therapy as well, we try to, uh, we try to get results as quick as possible, but sometimes it's not it's not possible. Also, uh, abroad phages, as you know, is not um, registered and that is a big obstacle that we see uh, abroad. That's why patients come to our clinic because they cannot get phages uh, in other countries. Phages have been a part uh, in Georgian history for past hundred years and even future it will be more hundred years because with the antibiotics failing there is no other option to uh, fight multi-drug resistant uh, bacteria other than with the phages and uh, we see the role how, uh, and how big it will become in the future not only in Georgia but also abroad and everybody is trying to keep up the other countries are having trials are having uh, researches they are trying to keep up because they see the potential the phage therapy has and how, what a big role it will play in the future I just want to ask the physicians abroad, the international doctors, to be more open-minded about phage therapy because they are doing the researchers' trials. Of course, regulations are important, but in the meantime, lives are lost and the patients are coming to us. They could not get a chance for the second life back at home, and they are coming here to get a chance for this. And I just ask the physicians to be more open-minded to it and to be aware of it and to be uh, along the patient, along the way for the patient.